Hi viewers, welcome to AP Police TV. Today, my episode of the guest, 2015 IPS batch, Malikar Gark IPS. So, I am going to talk to you about the first time in the world. So, I am going to talk to you about the real heroes, Madam Pinvajja. Ma'am, welcome to AP Police TV. Thank you, Namaste. Hello, Ma'am. How are you doing, Ma'am? Yeah, I'm doing good, Ma'am. Yeah. Ma'am, Manopolis TV special guest design Jason program is Real Heroes. So, in the day, there are many officers. They are all in the public and they are all in the public. They are all in the special program. First of all, I want to thank you, Ma'am. You have spent your valuable time on the public course. First of all, we are heartful thanks to you. Welcome, thank you. Ma'am, the public wants to know about you, Ma'am. So, like, your birthplace, how was your childhood and your family background? So, do you want to talk about the public? So, basically, I am from Delhi. I have, uh, I was born in Bhopal, uh, Bhopal in Madhya Pradesh. Uh, my mother has, uh, is from Madhya Pradesh. But uh, since my father, he is also an IPS officer. He has been working in Agmut Kader, so which is primarily based in Delhi. So because of that reason, from my school, college, all my formative years, I have, come, I have uh, lived and studied in Delhi only. So in, uh, for college also, I went to IIT Delhi. Over there, I studied computer science. So, I, I basically consider myself a Delhiite. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Mom, like any siblings, mom, in your part? Yeah, I have a younger brother. Okay. okay. He's a lawyer. He's okay. also based in Delhi. Okay. Younger, younger brother? Younger brother. Yes. Okay. Mom, IIT Delhi, one of the top universities in our India. So, Akkada Chesin Nawal ke chala manch lef more than crores packages on it. So, comparing to that, definitely you feel salary paranga can be too much chala takko and chup coach. But, anta manch lef life ni meiru dhali yasi, IIT Delhi anta one experience unna dhani dhali yasi, meiru itu vayi paravata ni ki drive cheta ni kala main reason ma'am. Since childhood, I have seen the life in the services. My father, he is also an IPS officer. He is presently serving as DGP Andaman Nicobar Islands. So, I have seen his life. And also there have been other relatives also. My grandfather was also forest service officer of Madhya Pradesh. And there are many other relatives also. So I have seen that kind of life. And uh, during my college time when I have done internships, I have uh, I worked as an intern in IBM. So I, I got an exposure into the kind of life over there. So uh, comparing all the experiences, I felt that for me personally, I am a kind of person who wants to learn about the world as much as possible who wants to have different kind of experiences. Mm. Uh, so that, that kind of thing is possible only, I feel, in the services. And the kind of impact which you can have mm. as a public servant, mm. as a police officer, the kind of impact I can have if I do my job properly. Mm. Uh, the, the liberty to take so many inno innovative steps, mm. which can bring so much difference into lives of so many people. Mm. That I feel is not available in the private sector. So that is that was my main drive. Uh, I find this life quite exciting and quite rewarding, and I was very happy. I'm very happy with the decision that I've taken. Okay, ma'am, how was your IPS, ma'am? Like uh, UPSC. So of course, definitely IIT Delhi and definitely you should be a very bright student. So me and the wala that two IPS background family on the cover. UPSC is not such a big thing, but. Is there any special care we have taken while preparing a UPSC, or you just went like gone? No, see, UPSC definitely is a big thing. Even though uh, people, for example, I have had uh, exposure to uh, this kind of uh, life of services. But UPSC definitely is a big deal because uh, just lakhs and lakhs of people want to get into the services. And there are very few seats. And if you consider, for example, IAS, IPS, you will have only few hundred seats are available, around 250, 300, that's it. And there are lakhs of people who give the exam every day and they are, they have taken uh, leave from their services, they have left their jobs. Mm -hmm. The kind of stakes, it's a very high stake game. Yeah. So it's not uh, something I will say that it is very easy. So definitely, uh, but it is a decision which you have to take very consciously. You have to, it's, uh, you cannot be very casual about it. If you want to give the civil services, then you have to make it your main goal in life. You have to leave everything else, other distractions, 
entertainment even uh, other jobs many people try to uh, do some job as well as uh, prepare for services though many people have been successful at it i believe this is a kind of uh, if you have a upsc as your goal you have to be single minded about it and forget about everything in life and for like those two years or one year which you decide to take out just solely work on this and apart from that you have to do smart work not just hard work because as if you uh, if you you will be aware i think that the service uh, the sh uh, syllabus the syllabus of this exam is in unlimited it is infinite it is very open ended uh, from history prehistory to current happenings in the world anything that happens in the world is uh, under the uh, is covered in, in the syllabus so uh, so to deal with such a big syllabus you have to be very uh, smart you have you have to know what areas you want to focus on you have to analyze the pattern of the previous exams you have to understand what is it that the examiners are looking for and then you have to since we only have 24 hours a day so we have to decide what we are going to focus on and based on that uh, if you are you are able to make these correct decisions uh, from choice of optional all these decisions have to be taken only then and with some amount of luck which god will favor if god favors all this combined will can only lead to success in this field ma'am after your ips mm -hmm. you were to west bengal cadre yes. so that was your first posting there yeah. so how was place there so how, how was working there because in delhi nunchi you are back to west bengal i mean you were to west bengal yeah. so how was working there ma'am uh so uh based on uh, the, the merit list and uh, uh the vacancies i was allotted west bengal cadre okay. so uh, i have uh, not gone to west bengal before that i have uh, just for some visits i may have gone so west bengal was a very very new experience uh, as compared to delhi where i have lived all my life west bengal is a very different place mm. so uh, and then policing also over there has its specific challenges so it's a very good place west bengal it's an interesting place to work in and um, i have uh, for my first posting i did my uh, probation period uh, as an asp ut i worked in hooghly district uh, the, which is uh, near calcutta and then my first posting was as acp shirampur it is a big town which is on the outskirts of calcutta so that uh, as asp uh, sorry as uh, acp assistant commissioner that was my first posting over there it was a very challenging posting uh, over there we used to deal with organized crime uh, this construction mafia and these kind of issues were there on a daily basis so that was a challenging thing to work on and then uh, with regard to law and order we had this panchayat elections were conducted at that time over there uh, panchayat elections is very very um, from law and order point of view it is very intense so to conduct that successfully without any major incidents it took a lot of effort and then one more big thing that happens in shirampur particularly as you might be knowing there is this jagannath puri rath yatra is there so that is india's biggest uh, rath yatra after that the second biggest rath yatra uh, is uh, in um, shirampur so it is also ha it also happens on the same day um, it is a very very big uh, 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 law and order uh, and uh, as acp i had an opportunity to uh, take care of that so lakhs of people gather in that around 5 to 6 lakhs people uh, gather on one stretch of road to manage it uh, to ensure the pulling of all the uh, the rath without any casualties ma'am i have one question ma'am that many people are confused ma'am mir mm -hmm. west bengal cadre ayundi ipudu ap ki deputation med ochcharu ani cheppi chaala mandi they were thinking mm -hmm. is it true mir west bengal cadre deputation med ikkadiki ochcharu or ap cadre i am ap cadre so for once and for all i would like to <laughs> clarify this that uh, i was initially allotted to uh, west bengal cadre అది సిలెక్షన్ వెంటనే వాళ్ళు నాకు వెస్ట్ బెంగాల్ అలాట్ చేశారు బట్ ఇన్ ఆల్ ఇండియా సర్వీస్ వీ హ్యావ్ దిస్ ప్రొవిజన్ వేర్ మ్యారేజ్ తర్వాత హస్బెండ్ వైఫ్కి సేమ్ క్యాడర్లో షిఫ్ట్ చేస్తారు సో ఆన్ దాట్ బేసిస్ ఐ అప్లైడ్ ఫర్ పర్మనెంట్ ట్రాన్స్ఫర్ టు ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ సో నౌ ఐ ఐఎమ్ కన్సిడర్డ్ ఎస్ అన్ ఆఫీసర్ ఆఫ్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ క్యాడ
and I will throughout my service I will remain in Andhra Pradesh only. Okay, that's great, ma'am. Ma'am, so Elano, if we chipper, what do we want to know? Like, how was uh, your marriage? So, my husband got a kind of IPS, yes. so vocal general girl. Yes. So, how was your journey? So, my relation yes. like. We have been knowing each other for since college time uh, because we both were in the same department in IIT. We both studied computer science together. So we have been knowing each other for a long time and uh, after selection during training days uh, that time. Both applied at the same time ma'am? Uh, no, uh, we both gave the exam at the same time but mm -hmm. he got selected one year uh, later to me. Okay. So okay. I am 2015 batch, he is 2016. Okay. But during uh, our training it happens that phase 1 and phase 2 mm -hmm. for some time they are at the same, uh, in the academy at the same time. Okay. So at that time uh, we decided that uh, we mm -hmm. can get married. So that is how it happened. Okay, ma'am. Ma'am, and uh, me, baby Gurinj, what do we wanted to know? Yeah, uh, we have a son. Uh, mm -hmm. His name is uh, Vedant. Vedant. He's okay. uh, just completed two years in January. Okay. So he's quite uh, mm -hmm. quite an active child. Yeah. Ma'am, general ka oka family la idhar employees inte ne difficult task. So meeru IPS, sir also IPS. That too, sir was working at CM office. Yes. So definitely a chala big untundadi. Uh, so uh, management can even go down. So as a female, uh, how you are leading it ma'am? So what is that secret we wanted to know? See definitely when husband and wife are both working, the chala challenging only for both and especially after you have a child, it becomes even more challenging. So uh, it are two things. First, for uh, sir and Nako uh, Samidhi clear only that family is always first priority after work. So whenever we get any free time or after we have finished our work, uh, we focus on our family. So Adi Okati. And secondly, luckily I have had very good family support. Uh, uh, sir's mother, my mother-in-law, she has been very, very supportive. So uh, SP posting Vachin Napadu Nji, Ame Ikda Unnaru. So she has been very, very supportive at the, because uh, when we take charge as SP, it is, uh, it is a very 24 hour job as you know. So initial days are even more challenging. Mm -hmm. So at that time, those crucial times, she has always been there physically. She has been here mm -hmm. and taking care of all the uh, family aspects, domestic aspects of life so that I can work with a free mind and do justice to my duty as SP. Mm -hmm. So luckily I have been very, uh, she has been very supportive to us. So both these and as a family, we are clear that our uh, after work, our main most important thing for us is our family. So we take as much time as possible wherever we get. We take time out to be with each other and to be with our child. So that uh, this aspect is taken care of. Okay, fine. Ma'am, after your uh, additional SP Krishna district, you have worked with the Krishna district. And then the you have come SP, as a SP cadre, you have come So, how do you feel, ma'am? Like Prakasam Jilla, I mean, Telugu people, I mean, in the country, Chalamandi, Grievance, Sivatan, Ki, me the Gurkos to under. So, how was that, ma'am? Telugu people allow on our world, while a badly me could chip corner to put me in the country. You are very good at Telugu, Mir Matlar, and take Priti Padam got a chala clear gown daddy. So, how is this people receiving you, and how you know this Telugu language, and the perfect girl? So, Idi marriage, marriage up to Nunchi, Nenu, I we got. Uh, we thought about coming to AP only. Mm. So, uh, I started learning Telugu when I was in West Bengal itself. So, I was in West Bengal itself. Only read and write code. The write and write code. Both I am able to do. So, I have, been, I have worked hard on Telugu. And uh, so, I could, uh, so uh, transfer uh, went in here, even Krishna, Pudu, I did not face that much difficulty. Okay. And as SP ga, I could have watched in Tarvata, I have to say that Telugu people have received me very nicely. Uh, public also and uh, my department also, they have been very welcoming and uh, to me. And Ikada Vachin Tarvata, there is so much uh, good response from people. We conduct, uh, even we conduct grievance days very seriously over here in Prakashan district. Mm -hmm. Like every Monday we organize Pandana. Mm -hmm. And even other days also, uh, we are uh, open to anybody who comes to SP office. Okay. Uh, and uh, even anybody who gives any phone call to SP also, we have a special cell. Mm -hmm. So any person who calls the SP, I try to attend as many calls as possible. Mm -hmm. But suppose if I am busy, uh, we have a, a grievance cell. Mm -hmm. 
so any person who calls their matter is addressed so adi uh, people have been very uh, responsive to uh, my coming over here and uh, i feel uh, i'm i feel very lucky that i have got an opportunity to work in andhra pradesh okay yeah. that's really great ma'am ma ippudu almost like the uh, gedega one year you are coming to this so meeku baaga ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ అనిపించిన కేస్ ఛాలెంజ్ గా తీసుకొని మీరు సాల్వ్ చేసిన కేస్ ఏదైనా ఒక కేస్ కెన్ యూ షేర్ విత్ అస్ యా సో యాజ్ యూ మైట్ బి నోయింగ్ ఈ టంగుటూర్ ఒక పోలీస్ స్టేషన్ ఉంది ప్రకాశం జిల్లాలో అక్కడ డిసెంబర్ టూ థౌజండ్ ట్వంటీ వన్ ఒక డబల్ మర్డర్ జరిగింది అది చాలా హారిఫిక్ ఇన్సిడెంట్ అది ఒక మదర్ అండ్ పాపకి చంపడం జరిగింది అండ్ సమ్ ప్రాపర్టీ వాజ్ టేకెన్ so it was a very uh, initially there were no clues we did not know there was no poss- uh, apparent murderer mm-hmm. otherwise many cases though it is known that this person has killed the open and shut laga mm-hmm. but in this case though ilanti any indications and clues were not there mm-hmm. so uh, it was very difficult for us unfortunately we did not even have any cctv footage also of the the crime scene was not covered by any such camera also so that we d- uh, so we started doing very methodically we made one uh, special investigation team we had did we uh, created over here and then we did very methodical uh, work so for example examination of all possible people in that area that we did all persons who might have uh, who have history of committing such crimes not just in uh, prakasham even whole andhra and neighboring states also for example even chatisgarh varku we have well done any person who has likelihood who would have committed we were verifying each and every person apart from that technical aspects also these analysis are there adi kuda chala so it took us uh, around uh, more than 2 months to detect it uh we did the amount of work which we did in this case it is enormous so ultimately because of the consistent work only the hard work that every day we used to sit on this case and try to uh, uh, follow some clue or the other so after lot of uh, work ultimately we were able to detect this case and because of this case we were it somehow happened that ikada accused he has done double murder before also in chima kurthi okay. in 2018 there was a double murder in which uh, one old uh, man and his wife were killed so that case also got detected which was lying undetected for many years mm. and then there were two robberies of 2017 mm. in that also two senior ladies were victims so uh, those cases were also lying undetected so because of this person he never came into police radar before this okay. so because of that more than 5 6 of our grave very sensational cases of old times also were detected in one go so it is just because of the systematic hard work which was done because uh, 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 because there were no possible no uh, the no apparent clues in the beginning so because of the systematic work of our uh, department of our sit it was uh, detected and uh, which really was appreciated by uh, the public ma'am as he accused him ma'am like it's a normal person or uh, any related to the victims no he is not related to the victim he has been uh, of, uh, uh, for some theft cases he was arrested before but he was never known to do anything usage of violence he had no background of it which was not known to uh, the police from that time so silently he has been operating for several years but he never came to the radar and it only now we were able to detect this case in fact 6 months before also the, of this incident in the same police station he committed one gold robbery in which 20 lakhs worth gold ornaments were stolen so that case was also detected because of this oh that's great ma'am ma'am alane me ee case tho paatu i have heard some baby missing case also ma'am adi kuda chaala close lane time lo kuda meeru chaala fast ga within very short term lo meeru find out chesaru ani cheppi i've just heard it ma'am so aa case gurinchi emuna details ma'am so idi markapur lo jarigindi uh, few months back oka chinna papa some uh, five days old chinna papa uh, he she was uh, in the hospital markapur hospital 
सो फ्रॉम द दर इज वन जॉन्डिस कोसम रेडिएशन थेरपी जो आ रूम पाप की अड़े पटोर सो दट टाइम दिस् दिस् वन बुर्का क्लाड लेडी शी जस्ट केम ओवर देर एंड शी पिक अप द गर्ल एंड शी वेट so uh, within few minutes we got to know about this kind of incident mm. and then we formed teams over there we started examining all the cctv footages in that area mm. we started questioning all people who were in the hospital who might have gone uh, to and fro mm. and we even sealed the town also and uh, the all lo- uh, roads which are leading out of prakasham district mm. uh, we put parties in all railway stations bus stands we really worked hard that day and within uh, within 12 hours of the incident that girl uh, she was rescued so she had been caught uh, she had been kidnapped by a lady uh, for selling to another lady who was childless okay. so because of this intensive effort which was going on we were able to locate the child and immediately she was restored to her parents so this is the first time ma'am that lady done or previously any experiences uh, yeah she had done for the first time okay first time for the first time ma'am so technology me the you have very good knowledge so technology in base cheskoni you have come up with no accident days so ilanti koni innovations meer chesar like this app downloads gani so how was this things going ma'am like first of all we wanted to know like no accidents day so ela meer dinni munduku teeskelthunnaru so basically prakasham district has long stretches of highway ఇది ఎన్ఎచ్ సిక్స్టీన్ ఉంది ఇక్కడ ప్లస్ మార్కాపూర్ అక్కడ కూడా ఉంది అండ్ రీసెంట్లీ ఈ పామూర్ నుంచి హైదరాబాద్ వెళ్ళడానికి కూడా ఒక కొత్త హైవే విల్ బీ ఇనాగ్రేటెడ్ ఇన్ ద కమింగ్ డేస్ సో ఇక్కడ చాలా రోడ్ యాక్సిడెంట్స్ చాలా చాలా జరుగుతున్నాయి సో అండ్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ దాట్ ద కైండ్ ఆఫ్ లాస్ ఆఫ్ లైఫ్స్ విచ్ వాజ్ అకరింగ్ ఎవ్రీ డే ఐ యూస్ టు హియర్ అబౌట్ సంబడి లూజింగ్ ద లైఫ్ ఇన్ యాక్సిడెంట్ i felt uh, very bad about it i felt that uh, because one accident jarigide it is having very high cost mm. uh, to the person and his family it is a very big emotional cost mm. and apart from that the person who's going out is the breadwinner mostly mm. so that a uh, person ki uh, some id chani pote or injury vaste it is it is having very big imp, uh, economic impact on the family and also on the society so uh, i feel that uh, road accidents deserve lot of attention from our department so dan chu see we started this initiative in which every saturday we have declared as no accident day so on that day what we do is the, our entire district force as much as it is available we deploy on different uh, accident spots which are accident prone areas apart from that we do analysis also and see uh, ki what actions we can take um, either f- from uh, behalf of police department or with other departments so kalisi mmmu cheyochu so that a spot lo tarvata accident jarugudu adi cheyadaniki mm cheyochu so for that every saturday we take up lot of activities for example where bushes are there in dangerous manner ekkada ekkada adi clear cheyadam ekkada ekkada signages ledhu ekkada ekkada these uh, speed breakers are part cheyochu all these things we look at so one day we dedicate our thoughts to reducing accidents and apart from that every fatal accident that occurs we go in detail of it that why it happened what could have been done many cases we see their helmets are not people are not wearing helmets so that day we take uh, steps to conduct awareness programs uh, we do targeted awareness for example if some uh, oka village lo some person has died due to not wearing of helmet so th- that time we target that village and nearby villages to sensitize them that this kind of incident has occurred in the village so uh, what steps we can take so that no other family suffers that kind of loss so we uh, take these steps and because of this uh, these initiatives we have been able to uh, get uh, very good results is it result ma'am so you are successed yeah. saturday when uh, accidents out there ma'am or we reduced it saturdays ki uh, tagindi plus in general kuda tagindi because of the steps which have been taken for example erection of signages mm. or uh, uh, putting this uh, speed breakers so because of that other days lo kuda 
accidents chala uh, tagine because of which so we did one analysis so this these steps we started taking on 1st september 2021 so uh, from 1st of uh, jan to uh, august data we compared and uh, this um, september october november december data we compared so when we compared this pre no accident day and post no accident day accident rate so we were able to find there was at around 27% reduction in fatalities 27% uh, deaths reduce and so around that that results in around 150 deaths so one if we go like this then there will be 150 less deaths due to accidents in prakasham district so i feel it is a uh, i i feel that it is a successful initiative and in the coming days we will even uh, increase our efforts right now we have been working primarily from police perspective so in the coming days we will take more initiatives to tie up with other departments for example rnb nha to create uh, more impactful initiatives and this uh, our steps have been recognized also for example recently uh, of a technology sabha award in the open national level award adi prakashan district police ki vachindi congrats ma'am thank you yeah ma'am alane esp gar i mean general ga chusukunte disha app download ante evvaru kuda itvandi oka competition laga petti personal ga encourage cheyatam anedi nenu chudaledu but you have taken at most priority because we can see many postings hoardings ivanni kuda meer chestunnar so asli ela ma'am like uh, why you are driving such a deeply so disha app is uh, one initiative which is taken by andhra pradesh police and government of andhra pradesh so disha app ok emergency app undi adi meeru register chesthe mee phone lo pedthe any time any even anumanam kuda vaste meeru just sos button press cheyali and immediately an alert will go to control room and also what is great about it is when we do registration we write our emergency contacts also for example your mother brother father any person's names you can write so they also get immediately alerted that your loved one is in this location and they have pressed this emergency so apart from the police even your family members and friends can also respond and at the, uh, when somebody presses the button that time uh, they are going to have this uh, 10 second recording will be uh, made so that police can get an idea about what kind of situation the person is facing over there so because of that um, it is a very it is a free service all you have to do is just download and register and it can have very uh, significant impact in the person uh, the life of the person who is faced with danger it can even uh, mean the difference between life and death for a lady so there have been so many success stories recently one uh, something happened in uh, epurupalam ps in prakasham mm. there was one lady she was having labor pains mm. and ambulance was not coming mm. so in the absence of ambulance uh, she pressed disha app so immediately police came and took her to the hospital and had there been any delay because akada uh, the boy the baby boy who was inside the mother's uh, uh, that time he had this umbilical cord wrapped around his neck so little bit delay unte kuda he would have been strangulated and he could have lost his life and that is the worst thing uh, it can happen a healthy child being lost during the process of delivery so because of disha app police immediately came and took her to the uh, hospital and uh, the live mother and baby both were uh, safe and delivered the baby was delivered happily similarly uh, we have had lot of cases where a, a woman recently a girl she boarded the wrong bus at very late hours in the night and then her phone also died after she pressed the disha app but police immediately got uh, some idea and uh, we stopped the bus and she was deboarded and taken to her parents place so th this is a very good weapon in the hand of a, a common citizen which is otherwise not available if you are stuck anywhere if you have even little bit of suspicion that something wrong may happen we encourage people that meeru press cheyandi nobody will come and say that meeru wrong che press chesaru idi correct jaragaledu not like that any we encourage all people who are having any sort of uh, uh, any woman in any kind of distress please press freely and we will be coming there to your rescue and this initiative so because of this because uh, i feel that this uh, this app 
is a weapon mm. of defense mm. in every lady's hands and i believe mm. that every every woman should be having this app downloaded in her phone so idi promote cheyadaniki and then upcoming women's day also is there so in that light uh, we started this program on 1st of february in which we uh, declared that every three uh, every day three lucky winners we will select and then every week we will call them to sp office and honor them uh, any person who has downloaded the uh, disha app recently so because of this initiative which is also being powered by our mahila police mahila police are present in every village we are having one contest among mahila police also every week the mahila police who gets the maximum registrations done she is also called and honored okay. so uh, so it is um, it is a very interesting initiative mm. it has caught the imagination of people mahila police are very motivated mm. even public are very interested in participating in this program uh, so because of this in last one month mm. uh, from 1st feb 60000 registrations have happened only in prakashan district because of this which is, which was uh, not seen before okay. this kind of response so um, so i request all women not just in prakashan district but entire andhra pradesh please download this app it is a free service which might come to your rescue if you are in a, a time of need so idi kachitanga mee phone lo డౌన్లోడ్ చేసి పెట్టాలి ఓకే రైట్ మ్యామ్ మహిళా పోలీస్ టాపిక్ కూడా మీరు చెప్పారు కాబట్టి హౌ ఇస్ దిస్ మ్యామ్ లైక్ హౌ ఇస్ దిస్ వర్కింగ్ సో డెఫినెట్గా వాళ్ళు ఇప్పుడు డిపార్ట్మెంట్లోకి సమ్ థౌజండ్స్ ఆఫ్ పీపుల్ ఆర్ వస్తున్నారు డెఫినెట్గా పోలీస్కి ఈ హ్యాండ్ కనుక తోడైతే ఇంకా పబ్లిక్లోకి వెళ్ళి ఎవరైతే ఇప్పుడు ఉమెన్ కోసం ఎంత ఇనిషియేషన్ తీసుకున్నామో సో ఇది కూడా చాలా హెల్ప్ అవుతుంది సో హౌ ఇస్ దిస్ గోయింగ్ ఆన్ మ్యామ్ ఈస్ ఇట్ గోయింగ్ ఆన్ వెల్ యా సో మహిళా పోలీస్ ఈజ్ అ వెరీ mahila police and the concept of sachivalayam secretariats in ward and villages it is a new initiative which has been taken uh, by this government so it is a quite a revolutionary concept in that that important department representatives are placed in every village so uh, village nunchi mandal headquarter raavadam kuda avasaram ledhu just sachivalaya velli vallu Uh, concerns ki address so uh, because of that we are having uh, more than 900 mahila police in prakasham district in every village mm. so this is um, mahila police is very very uh, i feel it is a very good initiative mm. because uh, 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 first of all it is representative of police in every village mm. and then it is mahila mm. so for what we often see in our society that women find it very difficult to approach the police station mm. Uh, first they are hesitant that evru em cheptaru ela receive chestaru adi kuda undi plus uh, then physical akara varaku velladam is also very difficult especially there are so many places in prakasham district which are quite far off uh, for example there is nallamala forest area over here the distance from police uh, station is quite short and it's not possible for somebody who's really in need not all people can easily go సో ఇక్కడ మహిళ వల్ల ప్లస్ పోలీస్ రిప్రజెంటేటివ్ వల్ల చాలా మంది ఫార్వర్డ్ వస్తున్నారు టు షేర్ దర్ ప్రాబ్లమ్స్ అండ్ మహిళా పోలీస్ హ్యావ్ బీన్ ట్రైన్డ్ ఫర్ దిస్ పర్పస్ టు హౌ టు రిసీవ్ దీస్ కంప్లైంట్స్ అండ్ దెన్ హౌ టు పాస్ ఆన్ దిస్ ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ టు ఎస్హెచ్ఓ సో దట్ దే కెన్ గివ్స్ అ మీనింగ్ఫుల్ ఇంటర్వెన్షన్ సో ఐ ఫీల్ ఇట్ ఈస్ అ వెరీ ఇట్ హ్యాస్ రియలీ ఎంపా ఎంపవర్డ్ బోత్ ద పబ్లిక్ అండ్ ద పోలీస్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ బికాస్ నౌ పోలీస్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ హ్యావ్ వన్ representative in every village and in prakasham district we have been utilizing our mahila police very well for example uh, we have uh, one one app application we have uh, we are using through which sp is directly connected to all mahila police so we regularly have interactions through that app uh, we conduct surveys we collect feedback from mahila police so they are always in touch with mahila uh, with the, uh, their sp they they respond for example like i sometimes ask them today what is the task which is given to you mm. so all mahila police give their feedback so they all feel connected to sp mm. okay. because of which they are very motivated and this is only for women police no? app this is for uh, uh, this we are using for mahila police only oh. right now and uh, apart from that uh, to so that these mahila police are utilized properly they are given the guidance that is needed we also have a system of uh, okay. mahila this police is only for women police no? app so in that every sho gives a task every day so every uh, uh, no, uh, what uh, the culture in prakasham is that every tuesday all the mahila police will come to the police station and to interact with the sho 
so sho will pass uh, information to them and they will pass their observations to sho during that meeting so then we have this every sho decides that what task he will be giving to her to do on wednesday thursday friday ilage for example missing girls ekada ekada unnaru vaal ki track cheyadam any kota information vaste immediately police ki cheppadam ekada ekada unidentified dead bodies unnai so sharing those details so that that person may be identified similarly um, the victims are there of uh, women uh, related cases for example rape cases and all so while ki appudu appudu kalisi counseling cheyadam so these are all tasks and apart from that also collecting information about illegal activities that are happening so these uh, tasks we give to mahila police and uh, due to this action plan they have some work they have a specific goal to achieve every day and then they collect the, they fill up their response reports and submit to the sho so this way sho is also able to get lot of information which is otherwise not possible and uh, mahila police also get a specific task from their sho and we monitor this implementation from sp office so because of which our mahila police are quite guided they are not lost the in mundu it was the situation that many mahila police used to say that idi we don't know what to do today how to do because shos were not able to monitor them so through this system we have a very good control and uh, guidance being given now ma'am now we have one interesting thing ma'am mm-hmm. so definitely ga mana police officers gurinchi mm-hmm. people they search about their sp the, or mm-hmm. their favorite officers okay so alaga me gurinchi kuda we have uh, chosen some questions ma'am actually these are the questions mm-hmm. were asked in the google search okay. so people were searching about you uh-huh. and some people got answers but konni questions ke answers raaledu so dantlo we have picked some questions ma'am okay. actually there are 20 mm-hmm. plus questions about you okay. so dantlo ka six questions mem pick chesamu so meer aa questions ki we want you to answer those questions ma'am okay <laughs> please okay. ma'am one by one questions okay first one malika gar ips dream yes ma'am <laughs> so what was your dream <laughs> so my dream was to be an ips officer which thankfully by grace of god i have been able to <laughs> achieve and now my upcoming next dream is to do my job very well okay. to be able to uh, deliver good quality police service mm. to all the people who are living in my jurisdiction okay. so that uh, their problems whatever are there can be addressed mm. uh, that is my dream for the coming days okay. <laughs> yeah second question okay because <laughs> you have instagram mam that we can see it is inactive yeah. so are you good in instagram <laughs> so i have uh, i have an instagram page but i am not really very active on social media <laughs> so it is kind of defunct only <laughs> yeah third question okay my best friend is my husband <laughs> yeah yes next mam next will be Yes, of course, I am married. Oh, okay. Very happily married okay. uh, to Vakul. Which year, ma'am? Year? Uh, we got married in 2019. 19. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Next question will be a little bit interesting. Okay. Yeah, my husband, uh, he is uh, Vakul Jindal. Okay. He is also a fellow IPS officer of Andhra Pradesh cadre. Presently, he is working as SPCM security. Yes, ma'am. my best moment yes, <laughs> it's very uh, difficult to decide uh, but the recent best moment i can say is when i was appointed as sp of prakashan district it was a very happy moment for me fine ma'am uh, public ki italian questions kuda meeru chepparu definitely we are very happy and new valuable time maaku spend chesi public tho interact avadaniki chaala help chesaru ma'am we are very thankful to you ma'am thank, thank you, you ma'am. thank you